so this is gonna be a sit down video as you can tell i'm in a different space i'm in kent state university so i'm gonna tell y'all what happened from the beginning to now since it's been super hectic and i just got really settled into my dorm my temporary dorm i'm doing my orientation today i got packed and ready took a little nap before and then we headed out the house at like 12 o'clock at night just to get here at like seven o'clock in the morning mind you i'm with my older sister and my uncle and we all haven't slept we had to sit and listen to the, the disclaimers and everything you need to know about the school for a good amount of time until we went to until we went to lunch. Now I don't know. I think I got a video, a clip of the lunch that we had, but or, I think I don't, I can't remember what I had. But they had a lot of options. They did have a lot of options. I tasted most of them and they were decent. They were, they weren't like nasty, disgusting. They were decent. But after that, we have to go back to, I think was the, I don't know where we are, honestly. Like I just found out where this dormitory is and it took me a while, even though we kept coming back here and going to other places and going to other places. We walked so much today and i haven't even seen the full campus and i'm kind of nervous on like navigating and remembering where i need to go but that's a normal thing you know when you get into a new place thinking of the events that happened today it wasn't really much but informational we had this little time where our flash flash guy took us to this room and we played games and we got a little insight on the incoming class of 2027 yeah and it was it was fun definitely some interesting people there so far i saw two two dorms and i'm in the coons dorm right now don't don't ask me about the name, bro. I, I didn't make the, I didn't make the name. I didn't <laughs> I didn't make the name. I went to go see this, and then my sister and my uncle is in the what's it called? I don't know. They in another dorm because I'm hoping to get a single this year because I kind of don't want to share how I'm feeling about the overall college experience. I'm just slightly, ever so slightly overwhelmed. It's absolutely beautiful. I saw some places that I can sit and chill by myself. So that was the upside. Some things that I'm nervous about is the whole partying situation and the whole making friends situation and getting to know people. I know, the thing is, I'll be trying to like, find a way to do that, but honestly, you can have a way to make friends. Like there is a way, like you have step one, like say hi, obviously, and stuff like that. But for the most part, you have to let it happen naturally. And some of your best friendships, ever in life some of my closest friends my friend group and my best friend and my other best friend like those relationships happen naturally because our energies and our bonds just clicked and connected and it made sense so the relationship made sense um i don't know that just puts a little making friends and trying to navigate this and happen to go to events and school and handling my books. I'm not too nervous on my 
work stuff done and I'm not too nervous on that but the whole socializing thing and the, having to be in a new place for a long time when you really think about it it's it's a long time a long time and they told me guess what they told me they told me I couldn't bring Salem <laughs> They told me I have to leave him at home unless it's a support animal. And I honestly don't think I can bring him here in this like type of environment. I have to focus on him and the stuff that he need while I'm doing the stuff that I need. Because honestly here, I'm trying to do a lot. I'm trying to be a full-time student be in my books have like a's and b's good grades like i usually have and i'm trying to obviously join clubs and participate in stuff like that and study abroad and all the scholarships and extra curriculars and sports teams and seeing if i can do x y and z and vlogging my YouTube channel, my clothing brand that I want to drop. I want to do a lot of stuff. And honestly, don't want to leave my baby, but like, I feel like I have to. I just, I'm just worried about him being taken care of like he needs to be, or him being trained like he needs to be trained. I'm honestly tired. Like my my, my sister and my uncle are sleeping right now, so. I have this thing where I'm, when I'm waking, and I'm going, and I'm doing stuff, I don't feel tired. But as soon as I stop, like, and I take my shower and I do what I need to do, I'm gonna feel tired, like, so tired. I haven't slept, like, consistently in, like, two days to get here. Wish me luck. Honestly, I hope I can keep up with this vlogging thing. Because so far, I'm not going to lie, I've been working and stuff like that. My new job hours are crazy. My old job hours was like, I had like free time and stuff like that. New job hours, crazy. By the way, I work at Midway Airport now. <laughs> Should I tell where I work? I'm going to bleep that out. But yeah, I'm basically making more money. It's fine and all, but I have less time on my hands. And if I wasn't editing now, I mean then, I don't know if I get edited now. Because editing is hard. I don't know. My up and coming YouTuber is like, you have, have to have the motivation discipline to actually get it done. Because in reality, it can be, well, my videos don't have a lot editing like tricks and stuff i'm not that raw with it but i'm just beginning and it takes me like a, a day on top of doing my other stuff to edit my videos if i consistently do it and that on top of me going to school i don't know but i'm gonna try to motivate myself along with like stuff like going to the gym i'm gonna really try to do that no i am gonna do that because it can be done that's all so many people doing it gym youtube clothing brand doing extracurricular stuff like i can do it all you can do it all call me on that call me on that <laughs> you you can do it all yes, mm -hmm. honestly one thing that I feel like I'm going like about this school. It's the staff. I feel like they're, I don't know if it's because people have been saying this back to me all day, like the staff are really good, but I've been kind of experiencing that for yourself. Like the police officer, I guess he like the head of um, security here on campus. The police officer came upstairs, had me, had me actually laughing and I don't fuck with 12 I don't I don't fuck with 12 I don't why you have me laughing I don't mm, mm. <laughs> it's just funny stuff like that it's really honestly 
chill. I wish I, I hope I have a chill, fun time here. And a time of growth and success and achievements. I know I have a lot of people rooting for me, my family, friends. I know I have some people not rooting for me. They can go kick rocks. To be said nicely. Some advice that they gave us was to really just focus on what you need to do so you can do the stuff that you want to do. That is it for now, y'all. Obviously, I'm going to update y'all on my Kent State University first year student stuff, give y'all all the deeds, stuff that's happening with my brand, stuff that's happening with my channel, my social media, all the stuff that y'all need to know. I'm going to keep updating y'all. You have to remind me my um negative 14 subscribers you have to remind me to just do that because i forget a lot but yeah i hope i have a good time here and this is i shouldn't be doing the outro but just in case i don't start recording again bye y'all love you all thank you for watching my video I'll see you in the next one.
I thought you went the wrong side. No, the wrong side. gonna be a vlog we're going to see the movie <laughs> that didn't even see me yet. we're gonna go see the movie the black in there we just went to the smoke shop got us four blunts we're gonna be has but in the lighter we're waiting on our lift i mean our uber <laughs> we're going to chicago oh we in a tesla oh, that's good luck that's good luck y'all we, <laughs> we in a motherfucking tesla he said he picking us up in the motherfucking Y'all, I'm sorry, like, it's like we're standing on the corner like we some corner ass hoes. But we, we are not. Over, don't. We're just trying to go to the mall. Ooh. The sunlight giving us, but that car right there. Fuck that car. Okay. Big check. Big check. Okay, shirt from, um, uh, World 21. Shirt from Walmart. Price from, okay. Oh, and shoes from Uggs. A body suit from Akira. Jacket from all in all. These converses, then yeah, I got the coat. The coat bag, you know, you know, you know. Yeah. Golf wing on the necklace. Oh. Nails from Five Below. We're gonna get high as fuck. We got some edibles and some blunts. We got like. We gotta show them the blunts. Yeah, we got. This ain't never said no green crack. I'm not smoking this shit. Oh, wait, wait, wait. It say green crack. This say blue dreams. Look. I'm trying to have some blue dreams, not no green crack. Oh my god. We should never got that if we said that. It's the only party is it'd be too much noise. You don't even got an intro. Have an intro? Not here, are you? Yes. <laughs> what's your intro? I'm like, hello guys. I'm like, hey guys, what's your intro? Because that's my YouTube name. That's cute, I like that. Worst album is like in the streets of Tokyo. Thanks for watching. We hope you pick up your summer with all the streets. He just fucking escorted us. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? Why are we taking it? Because he just did fuck with us.